installment of the franchise is awakening audiences again. The Force Awakens is expected to bring in more than $170 million on Friday. And while tickets are a hot commodity, NBC 15's Amy Flugsop shows us hundreds in the Madison area are getting a private showing of the film. Electronic theater controls, or ETC, manufactures lighting equipment for theaters and television studios and theme parks. But on Friday, this world headquarters is shutting down. Just for the day, though, as CEO Fred Foster is treating all 800 of his employees with a ticket to see the newest installment in the Star Wars series. Why? We're geeks. We grew up watching it. To help you understand just how deep their passion goes. The area we're entering is our R&D group with engineers and software, kind of a high concentration of the type of person who would really appreciate Star Wars. Take a look, Darth Vader, Yoda, and an X-Wing fighter. Never tell me the odds by Harrison Ford, Han Solo. Dan Telehowski, the technical products manager for Architectural Controls, is so much of a fan that he's not seeing it once, but twice. Thursday night, I'm going to see the movie first before the rest of the company. And who knows, maybe even again. In fact, and I'm sure I'll go a third time to take my kids. With so many fans in the company, Foster knew he'd have to do something special to announce the news. So a team put together this and it played last Friday at their company picnic. It took us milliseconds to find every costume and more extras than you need for our video. Brother of one of our employees has made a full-size R2-D2 to perfect scale. This isn't the first time Foster has done something like this. In 1979, when we were four or five people and the Star Trek movie came out, we had two telephone lines. We called one with the other, put them on hold, and went to the movies in the afternoon. And in 1999, He's our friend. Thank you. Foster okay, closed operations else. for episode so one, The Phantom Menace, and took 600 employees to the Orpheum Theater. So as excitement mounts inside these walls, they're trying to stay focused right now. Yeah. <laughs> of course I am. <laughs> I think we'll be forgiven if we're too distracted to get everything completely done by Friday morning. In Madison, Amy Flukesoft, NBC 15 News. May the, may the force be with you, as they right. say. Wow, well, it looks like a lot of fun working there. I know. It's yeah. a really cool place, and what a nice perk. Yeah. I think we should all get to take Friday off and go, too. Yeah, we'll see Boss. how that goes. The Force Awakens is rated PG-13. A representative from Marcus Theater says they can't give a specific number. However, they are predicting this could be the biggest film to date.